Hey everybody, it's me. It's Tuesday, and you know what that means. I went to my Weight Watcher meeting today, and uh, I gained 0.8, and I'm actually really pissed off and frustrated, um, and constipated. <laughs> Therefore, I'm drinking what I like to call Metamucil Cocktail. Mmm, yummy. So supposedly if I drink all of this, it will make me, it will relieve me of my symptoms. Yummy! But anyway, oh, it's actually kind of grapey. Um, so I was just really frustrated this morning. I mean, I knew it was because I've been having bloated and constipation all week. And I knew that was the reason why I gained. You know, so, um, I mean, I was hoping it would just pass, it would just pass, but it hasn't passed. So I'm forced to resort to drastic measures, if you know what I'm saying. And, um, and I was just so angry and frustrated this morning. I was just like, I was just so irritated in general, you know, that I was posting all kinds of cranky tweets on my Twitter. And, um, it's like, let me see, what exactly did I tweet? I tweeted... I tweeted at Joy Karen. It's like, duh, who else would I tweet at? <laughs> well, besides my friends. I tweeted at Joy and I said, what do you do when you're frustrated and upset and get to ups bleh. God, I can't even read my own fucking writing. That just goes to show, right? I said, what do you do when you're frustrated and upset to get yourself back to semi-normal? You know, and uh, he responded and he said, I let it broad inside and hate everything. Oh, to feel better? I don't usually. And uh, just the fact that he took the time to respond to that, no matter how goofy his answer was, because that, that was basically my intent. I tweeted this at him with the hopes to get a response from him, because a response from him would motivate me more. No matter, I, even, I think I even tweeted something else saying that I wish Joy Karen would just tweet me something. You know, even if he just said hi, it would just, it would just, it would just put me back on a normal level. But, uh, basically this, let me see if you guys can see it. Glare, glare. Uh, there. So you can see my tweet underneath, and that was his response and stuff. So, so that, that cheered me up a little bit. I just got home from having lunch with my sister. We went to Westlake Joe's and I got this, I had been craving like a really, really good cheeseburger for a long time. So I figured, I was like, fuck it, I'm going to go ahead and get it. I did my best to calculate the points for it. Um, it's a, I mean, it's a big fucking cheeseburger. I mean, it was big and it's on like, like a, like a French bread kind of roll. It's one of those kind of burgers. So I estimate, I guesstimated it at being 24 points for the whole thing. And I only was able to eat half of it. So I'm probably going to eat the other half later on today as my dinner. And I pretty pretty much, I estimated the burger and the fries as being at 34 points, which is three points over my, over my point total. So I was like, screw it, I'm just going to use some flex points. Not worry about it. And plus, if this works, um, I don't think it'll even matter because this will make me poo. Mm, magic poo liquid. No, but I, I, I don't recommend using laxatives to lose weight because I'm not looking forward to this. In a nutshell, I am not looking forward to what this is going to do to me later. But if it if it helps with my, my bloating and my pain, then I'm all for it. That is why I'm doing that. Oh, and I also discovered something else. When, uh, when I did my video yesterday, when um, my friend Mike gave me this Toys R Us gift card and a memory card what I didn't realize he actually called me and he's like you did that all wrong and I was like what and he actually said that I was supposed to put the memory card into my camera and that there was a video on there for me to watch I had no idea so what I did after after I talked to him after I had my lunch yesterday I popped the video in you know I downloaded it to my computer and I watched it and he has challenged me. What he wants me to do, 
with this uh, this is ten dollar gift card that he included he said I want you to go down to Target or Toys R Us Toys R Us Target both start with T who cares he says here's my challenge to you take take this gift card videotape you in the store with your new camera so he wants me to use my new camera to film me going into Toys R Us and find the weirdest wildest wackiest thing that I can buy for ten dollars with this gift card then when I'm done to email him the footage and he will edit it all together all nice and pretty for me and stuff now I'm not, at this point I'm not quite sure when I'm going to do this I was thinking about doing it today but the weather outside is kind of bleh, and, and I'd have to drive all the way to San Mateo which is probably about a good half hour away and plus I'm drinking this So I'm actually thinking that I'll, I'll wait and I'll do this next week. And then what I'll do is I'll also, um, I'll still probably still do a separate weigh-in video. But, um, because like I said, I'm going to have to send the footage to him to have him edit it and then have him send it back to me. And, blah, and who knows when I'll even get that video done or put up or whatever, but... That's that's the plan. I mean, I'll see how things go. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. I don't know. I'll see how my day goes. But basically, that's about it. That's about it. I gained 0 0.8, which puts me at 220.6. That's where I'm at right now. So now, in order to reach my goal, my VidCon goal, I have to lose 21 pounds in 13 weeks. And... Basically, I've I've done the ma the calculations on it, and my calculations really are not that different. So starting next week, I would have to lose at least 1.6. I mean, not even one. Well, let me see. 1.5 times 13. Yeah, a little closer to 1.6 a week. But if I could lose 1.5 a week, I'd be down 19 and a half, and that would be pretty damn close. So I think what I'm going to try to do this week is I'm going to try to use less flex and less activity points. Like instead what I'm going to do, instead of jumping right into my, my activity points, I'm going to jump into my flex points first. Then that way if toward the end of the week if I'm running low on points, I can... Because one thing I learned is that your activity points stack up. So And I earn about 40 activity points a week just from work alone. So then if I use all my my flex points, I still have those in the bank, you know, and stuff like that. Um, this is this is shaping up to be such a fun day already. You know, laxatives, uh, iPads, and gaining weight, and just all kinds of suck. But anyways, um, that's about where I'm at today, and um, I'd like to thank all my friends who support me and who have been helping me out, and of course to all my YouTubers. Not that all of them watch my videos, but if they do, I love you guys. Mm. But I love everybody who watches me because they're they're obviously cool with me. They don't care that I'm a I'm a stupid, ugly, old, fat troll who has nothing better to do in life than to stalk that guy. That guy. That guy! If you don't know who that guy is, you need to rewind the... go back through my videos and find out who he is pronto. No, I'm just kidding. Please. I'm the furthest thing from a stalker. You know, um... I just really like him a lot. That's, that's pretty much it. I just like it. He makes me laugh. And, uh, if you can make me laugh, then, then, um, you, you automatically get, like, a thousand cool points for that. And, uh, and whatnot, you know. I mean, I've just kind of gotten to a point as far as thinking about VidCon. Because I really hate being nervous and anxious about VidCon. So I, I, uh, tweeted, I think a couple days ago, that, uh, that instead of being nervous and anxious, I'm going to be loud, obnoxious, and fun instead. You know, granted, yeah, am I going to cross a few bridges? Mm, 
am I going to annoy some people? Probably. And I was even thinking, you know, when I'm at the dance party or whatever, you know what, maybe I will have a drink or something. Because one main thing about me is I'm not a big drinker. I mean, I usually don't drink at all, even though I'm 40. I, I just don't really drink at all. I only drink on occasion. And if there's something there to drink that I actually like, like I prefer, I don't like beer at all. Um, I like ciders. I like fufu drinks, you know, like um, pina coladas and and shit like that, which I, you know, like Smirnoff Ice, you know, you know, you know, foofy drinks, as I like to call them. But, um, it would be, if I was to drink, it would be something very, very mild, and it would not be very many either. I mean, at most, maybe I would have two drinks at the most. Because like, unlike a lot of other people, I know my limit, you know, I even though even though I'm going to be at VidCon, even though I'm not going to be driving, even though I don't have to worry about any of that shit, I still know my limits. And since I'm an extreme lightweight, I definitely wouldn't want to do anything too crazy, you know, because if I were to get, quote, drunk at VidCon, things could get really, really bad because I'm the type of drunk... I have been drunk before, by the way. I have been drunk before. I'm the type of drunk that would probably be disturbingly honest. And there are quite a few people at VidCon that I don't want to be that honest with, if you know what I'm saying. But, um... But, you know. You know. I mean, again, I'll cross that bridge when I come to it. Crossing. Ah! Falling off. But, anyways, uh... I'm going to go ahead and get going and finish drinking my, my, uh, my delicious grapey magnesium citrate or whatever you call it. Because the sooner I can finish drinking this, the sooner I can poop. And wow, this video is way too long already. So, I would bid you all adieu. Sacre bleu. I bid you I bid you all I bid you all adieu. That's what I meant to say, not sacre bleu. Well maybe I didn't mean that. But anyway, later dudes.